Hello. Hello, hello. We're still streaming. Still streaming. Um, been streaming all night, basically. Having a couple, couple of breaks here and there. Other than that, we are streaming again. And I will actually do, do will need to actually again promote the channel or stream on Twitter. Just so that people actually do realize that I am streaming still. Go in here. Still. too much because I'm watching the stream hopefully it's working hopefully everything is working at the moment loading video <laughs> loading video come on load it all right it seems to be working fine we'll see though Should be here. Hello, everyone who's watching. If anyone is actually watching, I don't know. Been awake all night and been trying to. I don't know. I've been watching a uh, couple of streamers and fixing my own stream here and there and some of the notification stuff. And things like that so being awake all night and yeah I did download the old Iron King DLC today so I need to be beat that one need to do that one and uh, um, what else what else is there anything else we should do as of now um, I'm checking checking things There is one place I should... Oh well, whatever. Let's continue over here. Should we do some PvP before we go into the actual... I actually do want to go get some um, human effigies. So I might do that. Or I will do that, rather. We should have one over here. We'll get one human effigy actually. We don't get like five or anything. Just one should be enough for now, I guess. So I'll go down here. And this is not a new game or anything, or new game plus or anything, it's just new game. I be using the human effigy a lot on this area. Right. Mm -hmm. Lagana. Lagana. 
baby chumps, human effigy, there you are. I just wanted you. Humanity restored. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Very kind indeed. <clears throat> I'm also actually trying to get all the achievements, like I've said on the past broadcasts. Also, um, but it's hard. It will be hard since a lot of those, uh, like sorceries and uh, pyromancies, are from covenants and uh, devotion to covenants. So that's going to be quite hard. Like uh, Greek Chaos Fireball will be way hard. Like seriously hard. I think unless you can actually buy it somewhere, but. Alright, so we are going to do the... It's this one? I guess it is this one. And yeah. Also, I will actually... Again, I need to check the stream on my Wii U here. Check check the stream because I don't have a second screen even though I should have that so I will have to deal with this thing doing the old Iron King DLC whenever we actually do get into the DLC will probably be a long time since I need to check things out and I will probably get more um, drink, something to drink, more, more, I guess that's Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola that we are getting, I have no idea, this, like, seriously, alright, you, no, not there, twitch.tv slash Leak. Right. So you can call me either way, Revan or Leak. It's basically two names. If you want to look at it like that. But it's one name, I guess. One word, one name. But yeah. Revan or Leak. Either way is fine for me. Alright, everything seems fine. Everything seems fine. We can put that aside over there. And we can continue on with the DLC. Oh my god. <laughs> I played the game so well. Where are we going? Right, is the axle... It's supposed to work? Yeah, it is. And do enjoy this stream, guys. Just in case the chat isn't updating, I, I need to like check it out that way. Alright, you... Get the heck out of my way. My way or the highway. I'm gonna get you, get you, get you, get you. I'm hungry. Why am I always hungry? God damn it. Maybe it's the fact that I'm actually been, I have been awake the whole night. So, could be that. Could be that indeed. Usually when I'm awake the whole night, I get very hungry. I'm seriously hungry. We did get a key. I do know that the DLC is here because this is the area. When I beat the game, I found this area. I was like, what? I haven't downloaded the DLC at all, but the area was still here, so. Um, where's my keys? 
right? Heavy iron key. Show item info. A piece of iron shaped like key past the altar deep within the iron keep and through the door in the tower that the old iron king used to produce iron. The unearthly weight of the chunk of iron is a reminder of the iron king's own immeasurable strength. Great. There's actually a key that has a decent description in this game. Alright. We'll see what this place looks like. So this will be completely a blind playthrough. Like, totally blind. I haven't seen anything of this play uh, game. I guess all of these are like illusory wall ahead. Yeah, like hell. Like hell they are. I'm just gonna check them anyway. They're totally not. Totally not. Alright, what do we have here? What do we have here? More of these statues, I guess. Can I talk to them? They're very weird. Like, why are they here? Why are they here? Because they were on. Uh, on the Sunken King? Yeah, the Sunken King, or rather. Were they on the beginning? At least they were on the area with the three uh, robbers, whatever, the ganking squad, whatever you want to call that. Um, those statues were there, at least. Usually there's like two summoning songs or something near those statues as well. Alright, so we get into here. What do we have here? A lever? Lever. Hmm. This feels weird. I know there has to be a hidden door here. No. No. Activate the elevator twice. Fine. <laughs> That's just fine. All right. Back up. I have seen like uh, Vladi videos, like some of the videos he's posted on YouTube, uh, but it's not like I actually know what's going to happen here. All right. Hmm. I know that like it would be dumb for me not to know about that little breach over there. Like the DLC isn't that new anymore yeah oh. what what are you I actually got scared smoke switch times six what a smoke switch isn't that like a like your crotch or something smelter switch Alright, what is it? This? Alright, what does it do? Smelter's Wedge. An iron wedge falls in this land, destroys the Ashen Idol. The Ashen Idol is a great consequence of to Nadalia, who, having renounced her flesh, entrusts her very being to it. The Ashen Idol is of the great Nadalia who bring around her flesh and trust her very being to it. And which folks in this land destroys the Ashen Idol. There's an idol is of great consequence. Alright, so this destroys whatever Nadalia is very affecting it affecting it off, I guess. Alright. Dun, 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 dun. I feel like there should be dragons now popping up and summonings like NPC summoning now popping up like hello there's nowhere else to run but forwards that would be totally cool right 
Oh my god, I actually hit something. <laughs> I hate ledges. I hate ledges so bad. Always get gets me the creeps and everything. <laughs> All right. I want to go down there. I would so want to go down there. All right. What's in here? What? Oh, what? Oh, great. That's just great. What? Can I like shoot you from afar or something? Please. Give me a bow. Boo. I want to kill you. You're not doing anything to me. So I'm gonna use a bow. With a poison, poison arrow. This thing is immune to any type of attack, I guess. Ah! Ah! Mommy! Mommy! No, wait, actually. Equip inventory, where is it? Where is it? Because I got this item. The action. Idol, create consequence to Nadalia, who's having a nice. Destroys the action idol. Alright, can I equip this? <gasps> I can equip it! Alright, so this should... If I'm correct, the way that this works is I run... ...to him... ...and use the smelter wedge. Yes! I did it! I know how this game works. Soul of Nadalia, Pride of Ash. Alright. Something's whispering in my ear. That I actually do remember, like Vari Vidya actually did post a video about something about whispering, like they were actually saying something in there. I want to see the soul. I want to see the soul. Soul of Nadia. Um, show info. Cat, please. Every single time I start to stream or something, you start to yell like an elephant or something. Soul of Nadalia, pride of Ash, who renounced her flesh and wandered broom tower. When Nadalia came to this land, the king. The king she sought was no longer there. Disprided, dispirited, she forsook her own soul and clung to the high loom of the old king. This is only a fragment of soul and cannot be used in this state. Do I need to throw you with something? Go eat, you stupid cat. <laughs> Alright. So, this is already confusing me with the lore. Um, dexterity ring. All right. Um, because if you check out the item, this one, um, it says that uh, an iron wedge forts in this land, and like this thing destroys the ashen idol. And the one that we saw on, like right now, was spewing the flames and stuff. That apparently was the Ashen Idol that it can destroy, right? And then this says also that uh, Nadalia uh, renounced her flesh and entrusted everything to the Ashen Idol. So Nadalia trusted everything to this Ashen Idol, alright? Uh, when Natalie him thought this pride that she forsook her own soul and clung to the heirlooms of the older. So, 
so basically the Ashen Idol is an heirloom of the king that Nadalia made her soul fragmented through like there's a lot of those idols around and those are like the only things left of the iron king, I guess. Alright, alright, sounds well more interesting than I thought it would sound like. Alright, let's jump in. What does this do? What does this do? Nothing. Nothing at all. Jump down here. Old growth bomb. So yeah. Even though I said it didn't make much sense, it actually does make a lot of sense. Cat, please. Alright. Over here. What do we have? Oh my god, not now. God damn it. Alright. Can we beat this guy? Bonk. Alright. Usually, or sometimes my keyboard, like when I press W, like forwards, um, it sticks to it and I like need to repeat it then. Twilight Herb. Cat, please, for the love of God. I need to go check out what's wrong with my cat. Alright, I'll be right back with this. So, please do enjoy the on break screen that is on the screen right now. Please do enjoy it. We are going through with the um, old Iron King, so we'll be right back. And we are back. I have something to eat here. Taking a little bit of a break. Gotta eat food. Food. Nom nom nom. Mm. I have no idea what the cat is. Probably after some food again. Alright. Cat, please just stop it. You are being annoying. Alright. Let's continue on. I'm sorry about the cat, if you can hear it background, like, why why am I even sorry about the cat, it's a cat and he don't understand when to be quiet, but it's very, uh, it's just funny that every single time that I start to do something, like stream or something, every single time I, uh, there's a lot of blood stains here, I guess. Oh. 
What should I do? A lot of blood stains, actually. Quickly kill these guys. What am I doing using a divine blessing here? This is just stupid. Big up item. Soul for Broad Knight. Great. Great, great, great. So yeah, we are using the... If you want to check out my equipment. Actually, this is completely useless at the moment. Well, not completely useless, but I'm not gonna use it. Something's whispering to my ear com constantly. Alright. So these are the things that we are currently using. What the heck is that noise? That's annoying. Rouge water. Something's whispering to my ears. I don't know. So yeah, uh, as I was saying, uh, raw black dragon, great axe, uh, puzzling stone sword, plus five, longbow, plus ten, black dragon shield, plus five, magic with three brands, plus ten, and these, uh, dragon like helm, uh, throne defender armor, throne defender gauntlet, and mastodon thingy, and these are the uh, rings. we do next? Go down here, I guess. No, I don't want to climb down yet. There has to be something here. Has to be. I knew it. Black Beat Bomb. Great. Wasn't very useful. Get this thing. Sky plus seven. Huh. Oh. Well, this was pointless. Alright, what's in here? Prism stones. There has to be some kind of way out of here. There has to be a... Really, cat? What is it? What? You have food. Everything is fine. Get out. Get out of here. Beard cat. I don't want to walk down. No. Seriously cat. Chest. Yes. It is a chest. Open it up. What's in there? Titanite slab. Oh, great. There has to be some kind of bonfire somewhere. I need a bonfire right now. Oh. Righty then. I'm just gonna walk past here. you as well. Right. That went actually better than expected. I was totally expecting there to be like 10 of those guys here. I just saw one of them and I was thinking maybe there's like a just one of them instead. So I tried it and it worked out fine. Alright, I need to do that. Oh man! There's a lot of those guys actually coming up. 
Oh man. Great. Please die. Thank you. Luckily I have a great weapon to use against these guys. Yes, use the smelter rats on her or it idle thingy. I have no idea what it is. Hey, we did it. Soul of Nadali again. There has to be a bonfire near. It just has to be. Alright, what's in here? Sorry. Burp. Burp everywhere. Alright, there's nothing there then. Fine. Um, let's go in this direction first. Oh. I'm like waiting for an ambush or something. Oh, I totally knew this was going to happen. Hello. Thanks for dying. Lloyd's talisman. Yeah, that's not an illusory wall. <laughs> I bet everyone has just said that this that exact same line. Water. Ew. There's actually water in here. So I guess I will need to drench myself into it, probably. Soul vessel and old radio left him and wilted dust herbs. There also has to be a bonfire somewhere. I need a bonfire, goddammit. Please. Hurrah for rolling. Yeah. Hurrah indeed. I guess they're just poisonous. Filled with poison. And then you get poisoned and it's like... You, di you die. Alright. What could be in here? Ooh. Barrel dudes. Fine. I'm just gonna cheese you all. Could they actually cause a... They could probably cause something here. Especially if there's barrels right there, so of course they're gonna explode them or something. Barrel dude! There you go. Thank you. You guys do that. Now we're like drenched in it. <laughs> That's just great. Drenched in um, gunpowder, so we will probably explode if we try to get there. I'll just go past it. Ooh. Oh 
What are you? What the heck are you? Very weird creature, that's what. Golden fruit beam. Oh, hello. Yeah, don't go near those guys. Just shoot them with arrows. That's the way you do it. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Right, there has to be a That's not an illusory wall. It is not an illusory wall. Just great. There has to be an illusory wall. I need a bonfire, please, for the love of, love of God. A bonfire, please. Oh well, let's continue on then. Since there's no bonfires. So far it's been quite easy DLC actually. Quite easy. Alright, there's one dude. No, don't follow it in. Check all the balls. Sniper spot. Sniping what? Um, there's actually more of those guys. Just great. Oh my god! So if this is a sniping spot... Oh, it is actually. Yay. Right. I tried to parry you, but it didn't work with this stupid shield. Choke on your own blood. That's how this game works. Alright. This has to be a trap. Yep. Nope. It is not. Sisters. Ah, the cat. The cat and his problems. Alright, I'm gonna give him some more food even though he has like a gazillion grams of food already. Alright, we'll be right back. And we are back, back again, with blind playthrough of Dark Souls 2, Crown of the Sunken King, a DLC, not Crown of the Sunken King, um, Crown of the Old Iron King, yeah, 
that's it. That's the one. Alright. I have to check the stream once more. Everything should be fine. <gasps> Bonfire! But it seems to have enemies in it. This is way too... That's if that's the coop area then is it? Maybe it is. Right, I'm completely clueless as to what to do next. Go here. We'll see about that. Ooh. Elevator that doesn't work. A thingy that doesn't work either. Alright. And that's water. I just I'm just gonna go check out what's in here first. Alright, there's a guy with in here with That works. Just checking out this area first. Um, think carefully and they try lesser fall. Damn costs! Don't you dare. In short, luring out requires a head. Hmm. Seems very... Trying to follow the leads of these guys who actually sent some messages on the... from this side. Alrighty. Um, go here. I don't know. Let's just try this one. what I'm doing. There's like a demon thingy over there. Try luring it out and then range battle. Alright. Hmm. Not sure if I want to tr jump down there just yet. I want to go through this area first. I completely. Alright. Hmm, could it be? 
Axel. That I can... Oh, man! That actually worked! I just saw the barrels there and I was like... If I hit through the floor... The door, not the floor, but the door instead. Huh. That was great. And then I. Can I? Use like range battle on that guy, perhaps. being annoying. Please walk somewhere where I can actually shoot you. Alright, I'm gonna try. using hexing arms by the way. Might as well use these instead. Alright. Got that one done. Man, we are doing great progress here. Great progress with the DLC so far. There's a guy over there. I don't want to go and fight him. Definitely don't want to. Right, can I snipe this guy from here? I can. There's one more. Oh, hello. Might as well just do you this way. I'm in no hurry, Axel. I'd rather just do things carefully then. Try to, try to force myself through. out of the bullets. I did it. I totally did it. Great. Great, great, great. Use the damn thing. That's the way you play Dark Souls. Soul of Nadalia. Hello. Oh, 
Oh, you can, sir, why not? What the heck? How do you even fight? You're like going all over the place. Well, that's the benefits of actually being on soul level 200. By the time you actually do a DLC, that's not meant for this soul level. Alright. Onwards then. Nope. And I'm out of arrows as well. That's great. Should I probably lure these guys out? Oh! Sneaky! That was totally sneaky. This is gonna be fun. So the game is getting quite hard. Oh. Oh. Have that then. You can warp. That's great. Human effigy. Zero deaths. Deaths in this DLC so far. Dash, then chug. What? Dash and then chug. Yeah, probably if you run through there, like. Yeah. Could work. This area is starting to be very hard. Oh man. Come on. Pine resin. Do I want to go there? Probably not. Ambush there for tri shield. Ambush ahead. Yep. That was an ambush indeed. Just die. Just die, please. Large soul arrow. 
soul of a hero. What? Was that it? Really? There's nothing else here. Please. That couldn't be it. Oh, there's actually an item. Oh, soul of a great hero. There has to be something else here. It just has to. I want the bonfire again. Bonfire, please! Oh man, what's in here? This area is so bright and colorful. Roll stone. Thank you kindly. Alright, and then there's that area. Alright, alright, alright. Where should I go? Where should I go? And if this is a boss fight, I'm gonna rage. Please don't be a boss fight. It's not great. Great, great, great. Alright, this seems like the way forward, so I'm not gonna go there right now. I'm gonna go here first and see what's in here. Behind me? Oh, hello. Where are you going? Where the heck is he going? You're coming back or what? Weird NPC summon. Very weird indeed. Oh, hello. Oh, why are we getting cursed in this area. Did I actually equip the petrification? Okay. Yeah, there's the curse. Alright. So we are doing this one then. 
really. Alright. Oh, hello. So you don't even die. That's just great. Just great then. I guess I have to run past everything. Whew. Thought that was a safe zone. Gonna run then. Run past everything. Hello. Hello, cursed. Of course I am cursed. Kill you, please. And I get backstabbed. At least I killed the damn thing. That area though. Man. Oh, right. I actually should have probably opened the. That's not open from this side. What? Just hit me. Oh. Hello. Alright. So I need to do this area again. That's just great. Well, up. Yeah. Indeed. I didn't activate any of the shortcuts that I needed to activate. Really? Really game you do, do this to me? Oh man. Was not expecting that to happen. <laughs> I think the door is still locked. Right? No, it's not. Alright. That's cool. That is cool, but I'm going to still work this out. run I did it please let there be a bonfire please 
joy I had. What could that joy be? There's no bonfire here. Vision of pointless. Yep. Well, at least I get to skip things. I might as well just equip the Catherine. Where are you, Catherine? Catherine! There you are. And back to the curse room. Then perhaps if I activate this area here. Hmm, we'll see. Alright. There's some water urns. More water urns. More water urns. There's a lot of water urns at least. Spell quartz ring. Bonfire. I got a bonfire. Right, what's in here? What the heck? This area is like I can't even explain it how large this area is. This is ridiculous. Ridiculous, I say. There's like 10 million ways to go. Where should I go? What should I do? Blow the horn of this thing. Maybe. It's locked. Of course it's locked. Examine. No scorching iron scepter in inventory. Alright, so basically that just to told us we need that. Alright. Pointless. Alright, alright, alright. I want my souls back though. So we are going to go back here. Aldron Assassin. Alright. Let's kill this dude now. Really? And there's you. Oh, 
people have s God defend them it a long great bow I'm gonna use sorry <laughs> use that one because I do have some fire great arrows that I can use on you I'm gonna chase this guy. Ha! Invader banished. Thank you for dying. Soul of Naldia, Nadalia. Have been acquired. All right. Has to be an ambush here. As I said, there was. I did it. Phew. This is this has actually been quite a DLC, a lot more better than the first DS DLC. Majestic Greatsword. Um, very rewarding. The NPC summonings have been amazing. Um, there's actually a goal to do, like killing the statue or the idols, whatever. Um, like it's not just basically just doing the one and thing, like going from point A to point B and hope that everything will be fine and kill everything on between there's actually like a goal to it so I do appreciate it a lot great DLC so far I have to say although there have been a couple of cheesy moments like that NPC something I could have probably beaten him uh, on the second or third try but I decided to cheese him because I don't want to lose uh, too many times. All right, so I need something to this one. I have. Uh, all right, 
that's locked, alright, alright, alright. I get to go to the bonfire. Yay! And I can use a humanity right now. Would also like to go and buy some arrows, that would help a lot. So we'll be doing that um, when we continue with the... Um, if we continue, let's see who's watching. No one's actually watching my stream. That's fun. Um, hopefully I have not muted. Nope. Alright, we will be continuing this DLC tomorrow or well, it is already 9 a.m. at the moment here, and I still have my Coca-Cola and everything. But as of now, I will be uh, going to sleep, and when I wake up, I will be continuing with this DLC. And yeah, so far, I have to say, um, Old Iron King DLC worth every penny. Only like 10 euros would buy. You should also, and uh, I know it's quite late for the deal, like for me to say this, because the DLC is, or there's a newer DLC already, and blah blah blah. But definitely worth a try, and even though I haven't even gotten to the first boss yet, so just take that in mind. Uh, even though, like, sure, the enemies that we are fighting are very similar to the ones in the Sunken King, that's for sure. Very similar and very similar fighting, but there's some enemies like the um, uniquely moving enemies, very unique because well, they they move uniquely, and also the NPC summoning was great, and also the sorcerers that actually throw the electricity ball, whatever, and also the um, the smelter demon uh, version or yeah he was quite easy actually to beat but yeah everything is fine with this DLC in my point of view however we will now stop playing and we will continue this on the uh, when I wake up tomorrow whenever so yeah see you guys